Hello guys, welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl, Kinesthetic with the Kinesthetics, and I'm here with you guys today with day 16 of Vlogmas 2021. So I've been giving you guys a lot of vlogs, but I wanted to sprinkle in some sit down videos here and there just to share different topics, different things with you guys versus, you know, just vlog, 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 vlog. We're going to vlog, 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 but we're going to talk too, okay? So today's video is going to be my current beauty phase. This video is going to be my top 21 products of 2021. We're going to cover everything from body care to skin care to makeup we got it all okay anything in the beauty category that i've been loving for the past 12 months we're going to talk about it in this video so before we get started make sure you guys subscribe to my youtube channel i am doing vlogmas 2021 so i'll be posting every day from december 1st to december 25th so not only subscribe but also turn on your bell notifications so that you guys never miss an upload give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy drop a comment down below after you watch this entire video with your thoughts with your comments with your questions leave it down below and without further ado let's go ahead and get started so the items included in today's video are in no particular order i just went ahead in my stash and pulled my top 21 products that i have been loving throughout 2021 some of these items are newer like i started using them within the past two to three months and some of them i've been using since way way back okay since january they've been with me they've been my girls so yes but before we get started i did want to address today's look so my hair is in this twist out that i achieved with a product that i'm going to show you guys real soon my makeup is my simple 10 minute makeup look if you guys didn't see that video i'll link it up above this lippy is boss lady from the lip bar my absolute favorite all time red lipstick if you're trying to manifest being a boss you need this lip if you're looking for a red lipstick that you know will look good on your skin tone because this looks good on every skin tone i have not seen boss lady not look fire on any skin tone so just go ahead and pick it up it's available at target it's black owned and you're doing yourself a favor by getting it okay these earrings i got from zara if they're still available i'll link them down below but they're just like a basic gold hoop twisted you know little texture or whatever and then i'll just have on a little tank top because honestly it's hot in my room so yeah let's go ahead and get into these products so the first topic i wanted to start with is hair care if you guys know me you guys know how i feel about my natural hair majority of the time i stick to what i know is going to work but i do go off and venture and try off some new products so all of these products i'm going to share with you guys are products that i tried out in 2021 that i actually ended up really loving and have been using time and time again so the first one is this tgin green tea super moist leave-in conditioner when i'm ready to refresh my twist out this comes in so handy one it smells good two it moisturizes my hair so well and three the definition majority of the time in my vlogs when i have a twist out and it's like day four day five and you guys hear me say like oh this is a refreshed twist out this is what i used this is all that i used this is the one okay tgin put their foot into this leave-in conditioner it's also a nice leave-in for if you wear like wigs and you braid your hair down this will hold your hair down because you have to make sure your hair is moisturized under those wigs so with putting this leave-in in putting your braids in and then slapping your wig on on top you're gonna know that your hair is moisturized because the amount of moisture this leave-in carries is honestly ridiculous next up is another product from tgin i have been loving tgin products like I even said this year, like I was speaking to my sister and I'm like, if I could use one, is it really a video if the hood is not hooding? Like it's too late babes, why are you outside? <laughs> I was talking to my sister and I'm like, if I had to use one hair care brand for the rest of my life, it would be TGIN. Because their products are just that good. Like I have not tried anything from TGIN that I do not thoroughly eat thoroughly enjoy that i haven't reached for again that i disposed of that i gave away like everything i tried from tgin has been a hit so far so 
that goes to tell you guys how much i've been enjoying tgin but the next product is their miracle repair x curl food daily moisturizer i shared this product with you guys in my video of my perfect twist out on type 4 natural hair every time when i want to know that my twist out finna come out popping this is what i'm reaching for when i want to know that my hair is going to be nice and moisturized and defined this is what i'm reaching for so i use this in my twist outs but i also use it like if i'm just wearing my hair out because sometimes i don't like to put tension on my hair i just want my hair to be out okay if i don't have nothing to do if y'all don't have to see me if i don't have to make videos my hair just be out and i'll just put it like in a bun in a ponytail or just leave it out and let it be free hey boogie voice so i just like to slap this in my hair when i know i want my hair to be moisturized and it does that for me too i love this line it does have black castor oil and biotin in it and i was thinking about it the other day that this is probably why my hair has been flourishing so much as well because i do the aloe treatments i moisturize my hair often i mind my business i drink my water but i also use this tgim repair x line which has black castor oil and biotin in it which are two things that help the hair grow so i'm just throwing that out there so when i do my 2022 hair update and i tell y'all that this line has been helping me I'm going to put this clip in so you guys can know that this line has been the truth. And the last product for my natural hair that I've been loving is from Mazani. This is their Curl Defining Pudding. And I actually was gifted this item by the brand. Which you guys are going to see why real soon. <laughs> I like how... I, okay. You gotta... <laughs> and I tried this in my hair. And I was honestly shook by the results. I never thought to try their curls defining products on my hair. I'm just going to keep it a buck on type 4 natural hair. I don't really see it. So when I tried this and I saw how well it worked on my hair, I was like, let me be the one to tell you that Mazani products are the truth. Okay? My hair today was achieved with Mazani products, which you guys are going to see soon. But the definition, the moisture the shot and this is day one here and it looks so freaking good so yes i'm here to tell you guys that mazani products they do work on type 4 hair i do plan on sharing more of them here on my youtube channel but this mazani curl defining pudding let me show you how much i have left so y'all could y'all could know i have less than half left in the jar less than half left so y'all know how i've been feeling and it smells so good. Y'all know how I've been feeling about this one right here. Not only do I like my hair looking good, but I like to smell good too. If you guys know me, you guys know how I feel about fragrances. I have loved fragrances for basically my whole life. My father was the one who put me onto fragrances. He always told me that a lady has to smell good. So he always flossed me out in the, the most luxurious. <laughs> At the time, I'm like, you put a, you making me smell like D. Oh, like, oh. I don't even know what Dior was back then. But he bought me my first Miss Dior. He bought me so many popping fragrances. And ever since then, I've been in love with fragrances. And ever since he passed away, I was like, I'm going to make it my business to smell good whether I'm going to Target or the White House, okay? So here are three fragrances that I've really been loving this year and I would highly recommend. And I did want to mention before I forgot that Sephora is having a 20% off of full-size fragrances running until, I don't know the end date, but I'll put the details here. So if you guys want to pick up any of these fragrances or any fragrances that you guys want to get your hands on, you guys can definitely take advantage of that offer. And Ulta is also offering 20% off of prestige brands, including fragrances. So you guys can get one from Sephora and one from Ulta and, you know, be good. Or if you have to get gifts to anyone, you can go ahead and get it from Sephora or Ulta. But I wanted to mention that before I started blabbing off about these fragrances and how good they are. So the first one is Born in Roma. And I actually got this as a recommendation from you guys here on YouTube and Instagram. I asked you guys for perfume recommendations. And y'all were like, Born and Roma, 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 Born and Roma. And I was just like, I need to try it because you guys are going crazy about Born and Roma. So do I need to be Born and Roma? Because the way y'all was talking about it, I was like, I have to get it. So I did get the one fluid ounce of this fragrance and I low-key wish that I got a bigger size. But it's okay because I'm going to just get a re-up when I'm done with it. This fragrance smells so friggin' good. Like, so good. 
Y'all really outdid y'all selves when y'all recommended this fragrance to me. Y'all didn't know what y'all were doing when y'all put me onto this fragrance. Because when I tell y'all I haven't been able to put this down, I have not been able to put this down. Like, I feel like the bottle isn't even showing a true representation of how much I wear this fragrance. But Born Aroma is one of the fragrances I picked up this year that I have been in love with. The next one is coming from Zara. It is Ebony Wood. If you have been on Beyonce's internet for the past two months, you know that Ebony Wood has been all over. Ebony Wood is probably sold out by now but this fragrance is so good i will say that i don't want to say there's a learning curve but i feel like at first when you smell it or a lot of people i know that do like it now when they first smelled it they were just like it's too musky it's too harsh it's too manly and i definitely can see that but i feel like once you start like wearing it and once it starts like absorbing it with the oils of your body like the natural oils of your body it just does some things okay it just like reduces the muskiness it reduces the masculinity or at least that's what it does for me because at first i'm like how are y'all going crazy over this fragrance and it's just not you know what i'm saying but i honestly have also grew to love muskier scents this year so it could be that as well but this is an all day parfum and i do have the i don't even know what size oh i have the 40 milliliter 1.35 fluid ounce and I feel like this is the perfect size for me because I have also learned that I don't need like two fluid ounces plus. Okay, like 1.7 and under is fine for me because that way I don't feel like I have to wear something every day to finish it. I can go ahead and explore because y'all know I have a ton of fragrances. If y'all don't know, I have a whole collection of fragrances which I do want to share with you guys soon but this ebony wood is that girl so definitely try it out you can go in store and like definitely spray it on your body to see how it performs with the oils of your body and then go from there do not try it on a paper do not try it on the tester like don't just smell the bottle put it on your body i'm telling you guys and the last fragrance that i've been loving this year that i would highly recommend is the toka gia fragrance this fragrance i've been telling you guys about it for months i literally like it retails for 70 dollars or 76 dollars and you get 1.7 fluid ounces and it smells so good like it just smells so real mm. it's like an equal mix of like musk and fruit like i don't know how to explain it. you just have to smell it it's so freaking good the bottle is so gorgeous so yeah, if you guys are looking for a fragrance to either you or someone as a gift, definitely check this one out. So not only do I like my hair to look good, for me to smell good, but I love for my face to be beat. Okay, I love me a nice beat face. It just, it elevates any look, okay? So here are some of my favorite makeup products from 2021. First up, I want to address this, okay? If you know me, if you've been watching my channel for a while, you guys know how I felt about, well, how I feel, I'm not going to say felt because it's current tense, about Lancome's Teen Idol Foundation. You guys know that's my girl. If you watch my complexion routine, if you watch a lot of my videos, I mention that foundation. But towards the end, like the last six months of this year, I was like, I want to venture off, try different foundations, see what else is out there, see what else I like. So I did my research and one foundation that I really, really heard people speaking about and was like, I need to try is this Huda Beauty Full Filter Matte Foundation. I think that's the full name of it. But my girl Stishy was raving about this. She was like, Huda, 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 Huda Foundation, Foundation. I was like, let me go ahead and try it out. So I picked it up during the Sephora Holiday Savings event. And y'all, my girl ain't never lie, okay? This Huda Beauty Foundation is the truth. It's the truth. The coverage, amazing. I showed you guys how it performs in my full coverage makeup routine, 10 minute makeup that I did back in early November. I linked that up above, but this foundation is the truth. So I have the color Gingerbread 430N. And I actually mix this with my NARS Macau foundation just because it gives me like a nut. Y'all see? My face is matching my neck. Like who is she? Y'all know my face is either too light or too dark. So the mix of those two foundations definitely do it for me. But I would highly recommend this foundation. One, if you have acne prone skin because it is non-comedogenic. Two, if you're looking for a full coverage foundation that one, a little bit goes a long way and two, is going to give you great coverage check this out this foundation that you remember that i told you next up is a setting powder that y'all kept asking me like girl 
what you doing different with your makeup what you doing with your different with your makeup and i never said i was doing anything different but the fact that you guys noticed tell me that this product is the truth on top of me already knowing that it was the truth the compliments took it to a whole nother level this is a derma blend professional loose setting powder in original y'all this setting powder right here it just smooths the face out like when i say life-size filter real life filter filter in a real life this powder does it for you okay at first i was nervous because i'm like i don't really use translucent powders i really use like you know colored powders whether it be like a banana or something similar to my skin tone but this one right here changed my perspective on it all and i love derma blends products because they are amazing for acne prone skin they do consider skin health when they formulate their products so all of their products work for acne prone skin they work for all types of like different skin concerns so definitely check out their instagram and check out their brand overall because when i tell y'all that derma blend is heavily slept on it is heavily snoozed on. So while we're on the topic of Derma Blend, I did want to share a setting spray that I've really been enjoying. This is the Derma Blend Lock and Last Water Resistant Setting Spray. And I've been looking for a setting spray that, one, gives like a nice spray to the face. It's not like too direct and it's also not too like scattered. Two, gives me some type of like sweat proof filter situation. And three, makes my skin look good and last for a long period of time. This setting spray has checked off all three of those points. It is water resistant. So don't put this on and think that you're going to dip in a pool with your full face. Okay, know that you're going to wear this in the summertime. And your face is not going to be slipping and sliding because that was one of my issues. I would be outside looking crazy, baby. But I realized that one, I needed a primer and two, I needed a good setting spray. And Derma Blend's Lock and Last definitely did that for me. So if you guys are looking for a setting spray, if you live like in a warmer climate or you're looking for like a setting spray for the summertime, even for the winter time, then definitely check out this Derma Blend Lock and Last because she going to lock it. And she gonna last it. <laughs> Next up is a lip gloss that I recently started using. But I am so in love with it. I'm like, how can this lip gloss make my lips look like Cinderella? Like, when I put this on my lips, I always think, like, damn, my lips look like Cinderella. And y'all probably like, what? But you have to really put this lip gloss on to understand. Like, I just feel like a princess when I put this lip gloss on. This is the Patrick Ta She's Expensive Lip Gloss. And I figured out about this lip gloss and figured out it looks good on me. When I got my makeup done for my Vlogmas intro shoot. So if you guys watched day one of Vlogmas, I showed you guys behind the scenes. And I went to my girl, World of Charlotte, to do my makeup. She used this lip gloss on me. And I immediately looked at my lips. And I'm like, wow, I really look like a princess. Like, my lips just look like a princess. They look like Cinderella. <laughs> it sounds crazy. But if you put it on, if you have this lip gloss, then you know. Comment and let me know but this lip gloss is so freaking good it really it really makes me feel and look expensive so they knew what they were doing when they named it this but if you're looking for like a nice lip gloss if you're a gloss girl and you're really into like different glosses then definitely check this out this lip gloss is good for topping it's good to wear on its own with just like a lip liner it's good to wear on its own with no lip liner okay she gives us options and we love that and the last makeup item that i've been loving is actually something i have on right now Can y'all tell what it is? <laughs> it's my Kosas The Big Clean Mascara. Ever since I laid off of individual lashes, I have been in love with rocking my natural lashes. No strip lash, no extensions, none of that. Just my natural lashes with some mascara has been my go-to, and I absolutely love it. One, is quick and easy. Two, I don't have to fight with the strip lash for 20 minutes. <laughs> like, if it's a special occasion... I'm going to put a strip lash on, okay? Because I want to feel like a bad bitch. But if I'm just doing something real quick or it's just something that's like me hanging out with my friends, nothing that's like a red carpet event, I'm putting on mascara, okay? That's the tea that I'm giving all 2021 and beyond, period. So this is a co-size Big Clean Mascara. This mascara literally will extend on your lashes, okay? It'll make it look like you have a full set on. It'll make it look like you're giving hybrid okay it'll give you volume it'll give you length it does it all and i absolutely love it and it's clean beauty so not only will your lashes be popping but they'll be healthy too so this mascara definitely recommend if you're looking for a mascara that's gonna help your lashes grow because i honestly feel like this mascara has been helping my lashes grow comment and let me know if you guys tried this mascara if you guys feel the same way but this mascara 
bae. So not only do I like my hair to look good, right? Not only do I like to smell good, right? Not only do I like my face to be B, but I also like to take care of my skin, okay? In case you guys don't know, I have acne prone skin. I've been sharing my acne journey here on YouTube with you guys since 2018. So it's been a while now, okay? We came a long way, child. But I wanted to share some of my favorite skincare products that have been helping me out in 2021 with my skin concerns. So in 2021, my skin concerns have really been hyperpigmentation and dark spots i do still get breakouts like here and there these are some products that i've been loving for my skin one is this pre-cleanse i started using this this year and i'm like why did i not listen to cynthia when she told me to start using this sooner this is a dermalogica pre-cleanse and i promise you that this is the best product that i've tried so far to remove my makeup i don't use makeup wipes and before this i was using a pca skin um daily oil cleanser and that I will have to go in with like two, three layers to remove my makeup. But this literally one pump and my face, like my makeup is just like off. Like it's just like erasing. <laughs> like I don't know how to explain it. It's just so incredible. And a lot of you guys commented when I first shared it. Like oh I'm using this. And y'all were like yeah girl pre-cleanse is that girl. I've been using pre-cleanse. I breathe, live, and smell pre-cleanse. And I understand why because this is really the truth. So if you're looking for an oil cleanser, if you're looking for a product to easily remove your makeup, then definitely check out this Dermalogica pre-cleanse. Next up is another product that I slept on for a minute, but when I tell y'all I woke up, I woke up, honey, okay? This is the Topicals Faded Serum. I believe this is black owned, but everybody has been raving about how it's been helping them with their dark spots and when i started using this one my skin has been feeling so soft and two i've noticed a significant difference in dark spots that i have on my face so this product is formulated with choic acid tranexamic acid melatonin niacinamide licorice root and azelic acid and this product a lot of people ask me like oh is it like a bleaching cream no it's not a bleaching cream this does not have any hydroquinone in it okay we don't touch anything that has hydroquinone in it we don't let anything that has hydroquinone come out of our mouths okay we don't ever put hydroquinone period so if you're using a product that has hydroquinone in it aka mirad aka amb i'm just gonna say that real quick no tea no shade and definitely put it down pick up this product it's 36 dollars and it's usually in stock on their website if it's sold out it's gonna come back in stock so don't fret a lot of people did complain about the scent of this product and it does have a scent it smells like diaper cream to me or it smells like a product that my um physician used to give me for heat rashes that i used to get it just smells like kind of like old cheese like i don't know how to explain it but it just has an unpleasant scent but i can look past that scent because i know that this product works on my skin so i'm going to shut up i'm going to smell the old cheese and i'm going to lather it all over my face okay that's one thing about me if something works I'm not complaining about nothing else because I just want it to work. The main objective of me using it is for it to work. It's not to be a perfume. It's a skincare product that helps with dark spots. I looked at their Instagram and they did say like they reformulated it in a way where it still has the same effectiveness but it doesn't have the smell. So if you were worried about the smell, then they went ahead and fixed it. Okay, they listened to the girls. So I've been using this and I really love it. And I would highly recommend for anyone who is looking for a product that is sold on the market. Because a lot of skincare that I use does come from my esthetician. And she doesn't sell products to clients who are not hers. So whenever I find goodies that you guys can just go ahead and purchase, I'm always happy to share it with you guys. So this is one of them. Faded, topicals, pick it up. Period period <laughs> next up is a product that i recently emptied and my new one came in the mail today just in time to make her appearance in this video because she needs to be mentioned okay this is a skin suitables discoloration defense and you guys this product does retail for 98 dollars but when I tell you guys that I'm going to find it on sale each and every time, I'm going to find a way to get it on sale. I'm going to find a way to get some extra points while I'm purchasing it. So I purchased, the first one I had, I was gifted it by Durham Store when I did a sponsorship with them. The second one I have, this one, I bought it from Durham Store during their Black Friday sale. They offered 15% off on Rakuten. And then also I clicked like the no rush delivery. So I got a 15% off for the future, which I'm going to use on my next bottle. You see, I be shopping smartly. Okay, one thing about me is I'm going to spend money, but I'm also going to make money in the process. That's how you got to think. 
So this product does retail for $98. And when I did my new products for dark spots and hyperpigmentation that I'm going to be trying, I told you guys, I'll come back. I'll let y'all know if y'all got to pay $98 for this product. Well, I'm back to let you know that you got to pay $98 for this product, okay? If you're looking for a combination to get rid of your dark spots quickly, here it is. Here you have it. The SkinCeuticals Discoloration Defense paired with the Topicals Faded. This is your combination right here. This is the combination that will make a difference for you and make a difference quickly. So I'll try to insert some clips of my skin before using these products and then after so you guys can see what I'm speaking about. And this is like a month difference. A month, which to me is not a long period of time. So if you wait in on what to buy for your skin, you have acne prone skin, you have dark spots and you're like, what should I be using? remember that i told y'all and the last skincare product i wanted to share was something for my lips so in case y'all don't know your girl got some crusty lips okay and i am very cautious about my lips i'm like i never want my lips to look dry even though they do like in my vlogs i'll be editing like girl you didn't think to put something on your lips but this product i've been loving this is the first a beauty ultra repair lip therapy once again i learned about this product because i was gifted this product but I went ahead and I bought two more since I started this tube. Y'all see how flat this is? I don't know if y'all can see. Y'all probably not going to realize. But it's very flat compared to how it was when I first started using it. So this is almost done. And I will repurchase it again and again and again. I like it to just like coat my lips to go to bed. I like it to coat my lips like throughout the day. And it just does a good job with my lips. Especially like now that the weather is colder outside. I be feeling my lips sometimes like... What you, what you put on that your lips is feeling so juicy? And it's this. It's this. So pick it up. So not only do I like for my hair to look good. Not only do I like to smell good. Not only do I like a nice beat face. Not only do I like taking care of the skin on my face. But I also like to take care of the skin on my body. This year I really made a honest effort to treat the skin on my body the same way I treat the skin on my face. Just to focus on like skincare throughout right we want to treat our skin of our body the same way we treat our face like we want to give it the same tlc we want to make sure it's nice and glowy we want to make sure it's nice and healthy so these are some products that i've been using on my body to really just up the game when it comes to body care so the first product is this vanish pfb i've been using this product for some time now to help with my armpit let me see if they shave can i share them y'all can see they need to be groomed but um and i'm sweaty but this is a pfb vanish a lot of people ask me like girl how is under your arm so light how do you take care of under your arms and this is one of the products that has been helping me okay and i actually just found it on their website because i tell you guys all the time do not purchase this from amazon because amazon stuff don't be real okay i don't need y'all armpits being on fire because amazon sold y'all a dupe no y'all need the real thing okay i purchased mine from my esthetician so you can also get it from like local estheticians because i know some estheticians do carry this product line but this is the ultra so this one is for if you don't get ingrown hairs but if you do get ingrown hairs there's another one i think it's like called chrome ultra or chrome light or something but this is just the regular i guess you can say and it claims to correct heal and brighten skin and it does exactly that i use it on my armpits i use it under my booty cheeks i use it on my bikini area we need everything looking good okay the next body care product that i've been using that has really upped my body care is this necessary body serum i started using this when i did a sponsorship with them and i honestly really really love this product right here when i use it my skin just feels so plump and low-key i don't use it often i probably use it like once or twice a week because i'm like this product is kind of expensive and at the same time i feel like the benefits of the product like they last it's not like a product you have to use every day because your skin lasts like when i get in a shower after using this product that's how you can really tell like that's how i really tell what body care really like you know lasts what body care really like makes a difference on my skin and really benefits my skin because when i get in the shower and i feel dry it's like <laughs> but when i get in the shower and i still feel moisturized and the body the water is just like 
slipping off my skin that's when i know i'm using some good stuff okay but yeah this body serum is amazing i'm here to tell you guys that y'all need it too it is fragrance free so if you are like allergic to a lot of scents or you don't like smelling like different things it's okay because this product does not have any fragrances next up is another product i've been using for my armpits so I've been transitioning to, I guess you could say more like natural deodorants. So I used to use Dove deodorant all of the time, but when I did the sponsorship with Necessaire, I wanted to try this deodorant out before telling you guys about it. And yeah, this deodorant to me performs better than Dove. This is a Necessaire eucalyptus deodorant. No aluminums, no petroleums. It has AHAs, so it helps with like, you know, lightening the armpits and making sure that we don't have that dark halo under our armpits i'm telling you that you need this deodorant i don't care if this deodorant retails for 20 dollars. you need it you need it you need it <laughs> because i have never tried native but everyone i know that has tried native native is like so i was like try necessaire and two of my friends who used to use native try necessaire and they were like yeah necessaire is way better so definitely check this deodorant out they sell it at sephora they sell it also on their own website and it comes in different scents so they have fragrance free they have eucalyptus they have bergamot and then they have sandalwood so you know options and we love that so definitely check out this deodorant if you're looking for like a clean deodorant option and the last body care product that i wanted to speak about is this nivea body souffle cherry blossom and jojoba oil this product was recommended by Aaliyah's face and she mentioned that this is like a nice dupe for the Laura Mercier body souffle I think that's what it's called or body butter I don't know but that thing is like $80 and I don't have $80 to send on a body care product right now maybe in my future life but right now I don't have $80 to allocate to a body care product so this retails for like six seven bucks at Target it makes my skin nice and soft nice and glowy as you guys can see we have some leftover glow even though i'm about to get in the shower soon but it just makes my skin feel so rich and it's only six or seven dollars as i mentioned it's probably like 6.99 but yes this product is so freaking good it smells good and i love it because even though it has cherry blossom in the name it's not an overwhelming cherry blossom scent which i don't like that like that whole japanese cherry blossom bath and body works thing that we had going on back in 2000 no we don't need that mm -mm. this is a nice conservative scent it does a little bit without doing too much and we love that so if you're looking for a new body butter body it's a body souffle so it's not a body butter but it's not a body lotion to me it's like a it's like a halfway between the two but try it out and definitely let me know what you guys think so not only do i like for my hair to look good not only do i like to smell good not only do i like a beat face not only do i like taking care of my skin on my face and my skin on my body but i also like to take care of my smile okay I get so many compliments on I get so many compliments and so many questions like girl how do you whiten your teeth your teeth are so white and I tell y'all all the time I share with y'all all the time I tell y'all on Instagram all the time when it's on sale these crest 3d whitening strips baby professional teeth white and wear okay licensed teeth specialist wear all these little people on Instagram that be whitening teeth it's cool but this you could get for $40 and you could have your teeth white for a good amount of time, okay? I use these every other night. I don't apply them to my gums, so I do not experience any uncomfortable situations while I have them in. I keep them in for 30 minutes and take them out. Or if it's the hour-long ones, because this box comes with two hour-long ones, I keep it in for an hour, take it out. Some people ask me, like, oh, do you sleep with them? No. They didn't tell me to sleep with this, so when I'm sleeping in the mm mm, we don't need that because next thing you know, we have adverse reactions, okay? So listen to what the people them are saying. But I get mine from Amazon and they retail for like 47 bucks, but they be having them on sale for like 36, 24 dollars. So definitely follow me on Instagram if you guys are not already. If y'all made it all the way this far in the video, definitely y'all mess with the girl. So just go ahead and follow me on Instagram. But I tell you guys all the time when I see it on sale. So yeah, white teeth, crusty D whitening strips period and the last product that i wanted to share with you guys number 21 this video is kind of long but i had to share the goods with y'all okay this is the wax beads that i've been using so in case you guys don't know i've been doing my own brazilian wax i've been waxing my armpits my coochie the everything okay i get it all on my own yes when they say black women are superheroes that's exactly what they mean but these are the wax beads that i use and i've been loving them 
they do a good job and my hair is very coarse okay especially my hair down there my hair down there she's very stubborn and these wax beads like a little bit goes a long way which i love so i get these from amazon and they just do a good job like they do a better job than the wax beads that came in my wax kit so i would highly recommend if you're looking for wax beads that are gonna work on like almost every hair texture because i got thick hair down there like y'all think this is thick <laughs> baby get you these wax beads because they are literally the best so we finally made it to the end of this video and if you guys are still here then y'all need to make sure y'all subscribe to my youtube channel but <laughs> these are my beauty favorites for 2021 my top 21 products of 2021 if anything that was included in this video just know that i f with it okay i f with it so y'all should f with it too period so all the items mentioned in today's video will be linked down below in order that i mentioned them comment down below let me know if you guys currently use any of these products if you guys plan on picking any of these products up if anything in this video like stood out to you just comment down below and let me know and i did want to include a giveaway in today's video because i told you i'm doing giveaways throughout vlogmas and this honestly may be the best one so in this video i want to give away a mystery box of products included in today's video so you guys will receive a good amount a good handful of products that were mentioned in today's video not everything because your girl still got bills to pay and gifts to buy but i will give you guys a good amount of the products mentioned in today's video and it is a mystery box so i'll just like pick stuff put it in ship it away to you and that's that on that this giveaway is only open to you as residents you must be 18 or older to enter in order to enter the giveaway you must be following me on instagram subscribe to my youtube channel give this video a big thumbs up drop a comment down below in your comment down below make sure you include your instagram handle or your email address or some way for me to contact you and let you know that you're the winner and if you don't have instagram that is completely fine just include that in your giveaway entry and you must email me or dm me screenshots of you doing all of these steps in order to qualify as an entry for this giveaway okay this giveaway will be open until december 25th the last day of vlogmas 2021 and i will announce the winner on my instagram on christmas day so good luck and to the giveaway hope y'all love this video hope y'all made it to the end if y'all did i wanted to give y'all a little surprise because i know this video was kind of long i was just like damn girl you talking that much but i had to let y'all know okay so i really hope you guys enjoyed and make sure you guys catch up on vlogmas i'll have the playlist in the end screen make sure you guys stay tuned because as i mentioned i'm posting every day until december 25th and i want y'all to stay tuned because i got some good stuff clean okay we got some good stuff plan okay we got some good stuff planned because your girl's going on a little getaway and i'm gonna share with you guys okay it's gonna be real interesting just make sure y'all tune in okay but that's all i have for today's video until tomorrow i'll see you guys later